Am I naked? I feel a little naked. <laughs> Today's video is going to be a unboxing, well, an, un, an unveiling, I guess. It's not really unboxing because I've already taken everything out of the box and out of the bag. But this video is going to be all dresses, not just dresses, but mother of the bride dresses. My daughter is getting married October 6th and I got to find a dress. Luckily for me, there are a lot of affordable options on Shein and I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven dresses to try on for you today. One of them maybe more for the bridal shower and not for the dress. I wanna say too that these will need steamed. They, they've, they're, they're wrinkly, so, but we're not gonna look at the wrinkles. We're just gonna look at the fit of the dresses and we're gonna see if there's any of these that I like for my options of a mother of the bride. You know, mother of the bride dresses tend to be can be a little frumpy and I don't want to be frumpy. I'm not a frumpy mother of the bride. So we're going to try these on and we're going to see if I, if any of these will approve. Well, no, if any of them we approve, I approve, you approve, my daughter approves. That's going to be the hardest one right there. I will provide the links for all of them. And I want to say thank you to Shein for sending me these items to try on for you today. They have so graciously provided us with a discount code where you can save 15% on anything that you order from their website. I will link everything down in the description below as well as Shein's website and the coupon code. All right, let's go try on some dresses. All right, you also have to pardon my hair because I did not have my, this is not mother of the bride hair and we're in my workspace. So we're filming this not, you know, we don't have the greatest background because that's where I work, but this is what we're doing it. I, this one is very cute. I will say too, all of the clothes that I'm trying on or all the dresses that I'm trying on today are all a size 2X. Um, I like the color of this one. You can see we've got a little lace detail and a little cap sleeve on the arm. It's not bad, but I don't know. It just feels a little frumpy. I don't want to be, I want to be stylish. And I just, I don't think that this one is me, you know? I mean, it's cute and it fits perfect. There's no pocket, there ain't gonna be any pockets in these dresses because they're fancy clothes. So I, I like it, it fits really nice. I like this little, uh, what is that? A little flap thing or uh, whatever. I, I don't know what the word I'm looking for is, but I do like this. I just don't, I'm not too excited about it is what I'm trying to say. On to the next one. I do like this one much better than the first one. Um, I don't have the appropriate undergarments for this. I definitely would wear, you know, something underneath here for the day of the happy affair, but I like this one better. And I have to say, honestly, full transparency here. I have tried on some dresses in bridal shops. This is just as good. The quality is, is just as nice as what I have tried on in other places. Um, I honestly, in this one, I don't mind that I'm showing some arm. That's normally, that's a part of me that I want to hide. I don't mind it. I like the color. Emma's color schemes for her wedding are, she's getting married in the fall. So they're very fall and muted colors. And so I think that this would be good. Um, I just don't know if this is the one I want. I like that it's got the little slit there. So it's not as matronly, I guess, as the, the first one, but this one so far is my favorite one. However, I know me well enough to know that I will hate this for pictures because of my arms. I will hate it in pictures. So that's the only thing that I'm thinking about in my brain. Because you know, you try to make your arms look a little thinner. You stand with them on your hips. And I'm not going to be standing like that in wedding pictures. That wouldn't be a good look. So I like this one, but I don't think it's going to be the one because I just don't, I just don't think that it will be, but it is, it is really nicely, it's nicely, nicely done. And it feels just as good as the ones that were three, four, five, six and up hundred dollars. So this one's really cute. All right. 
Another really nicely made. I like the color. I think the color is great for a fall wedding. This is very long though. I'm 5'3", so it's it's really kind of long. And I, I won't be wearing like big high heels or anything. And honestly, even if I did at the beginning, they'd be probably would be coming off halfway through the ceremony. This one is nicely lined. You can see we've got two layers here. And again, the color is perfect. It's still just a little bit more matronly than what I want. I mean, I don't know what I'm looking for. Am I looking for like a, I don't know, but it just, this just isn't it. I do like it. I just don't think that it's the one. But I do like the color. So we're getting a little bit closer. Although I've got a black one too. And that's still like a thing. You're not supposed to wear black to a wedding, right? Especially probably your daughter's wedding. That probably wouldn't be a good look. But we're going to try it on anyway. And then we've got like a sparkly one. And then we've got one that might be better for a bridal shower. Again, I cannot tell you. I cannot stress enough. I have been to bridal stores. And I have tried on pretty similar dresses. And this is nice. And I want to see these were under $40. So you cannot beat the price. And the quality is there. So if you're looking for a formal dress to wear to an event on a budget, then I, I highly recommend these from Shein. Let's go try on a different one. I'm not a fan of this one. <laughs> it's the same color as the other one I had. I don't know what this, see that there? I would have preferred this not to be there and it to be like that. I, I'm going a little more Tisha Adams, which I like, which I like, but this is a very frumpy one. I don't like this one. It is nice how it has like this little belt here, but I don't like this one at all. We've got a little detail up here on the shoulder as well, but this one's definitely not, definitely not doing it for me. Onward. Okay, I'm so glad that I got an off the shoulder, like, I don't know what the technical name for this. It's on one shoulder and off one shoulder. Here, let me let me pull my hair up a little bit. Okay, pretend I got my hair up all fancy, okay? I like this, but you're not supposed to wear black, right? It isn't, you know, like an evening formal wedding, you know, it's not that. I like this one though, and but again, I know me well enough to know that during pictures, I'll be like, am I naked? I feel a little naked. I obviously need to wear a little bit better of a bra with this because I just have my bra strap pulled down on one side. That's not gonna work. It, look, we got a little slit here. I might be, by the end of the night, my clothes may all be off, I don't know, but this has a little um, a belt. And I don't know if it's supposed to be on the side or in the front or what that's supposed to do, but the little slit there is something new for me. I'm not used to that, but it fits really good. This is a size 2X. Um, I definitely like this, but I, again, I don't know that I would wear this for the wedding because then you have to really worry about your tan lines and all that kind of stuff, but it's cute. And honestly, for a, if you were going to any kind of event, this would be a great dress for that. Maybe have a little shawl or what is that called? Uh, do you know what I'm talking about? Something that you could put over your, your arms if you got a little cold, but it, I'm not going to be able to do this for the wedding. I know that because I know that it, I'll, it'll, I'll be messing with myself all night, but I think this is really cute. I do, I do, for some reason, I didn't think that I ever would, but I do like this off, one shoulder on, one shoulder off kind of deal. I don't know, but we're going to try on, we have a sparkly one that we're going to try on next. And then the very last one will be probably more for the bridal shower. Ooh, this is sparkly. I like this one in theory. Again, don't comment that I need better undergarments because I am, trust me when I say I am well aware. Okay, so this is a tighter dress. I like it up here, but, and honestly, if I had, if I had a better undergarment underneath it, I would like it, I think a lot more. Maybe not necessarily for a wedding because it's a little, it's a little evening. I mean, they're getting married in the afternoon. This is more, I think, for an, an evening wedding. Uh, but hey, this might come in handy if I'm going to some fancy 
thing, which I never do, but I like this color though. I am liking this like champagne-y color. Um, I'm not sure if I'm supposed to wear it off the shoulder because that one side has this thing right here, but when you wear that side off the shoulder, it makes this part seem a little big. So I don't, I don't know what that's for, if that's just for design or not, but honestly, again, this you know, I have tried on sequiny dresses before and they've been very scratchy. This one is very soft. And uh, I think that this is a really great dress if you've got the proper undergarments to wear with it. Very, very cute. It does very much have kind of that pencil shape to it. So it gets very smaller towards the hemline at the bottom. Very hourglass, I guess, shape. but. If I didn't have all these lumpy bumpies, I might like it a little bit more, but I just still don't think it's the right one. It's not the right one. All right, we got one more left to try on that I think it's probably gonna be more for a bridal shower. And then we're gonna go over to the table and I will give you my honest review of all of these dresses. And of course, this one would be my favorite one. Not necessarily, I mean, maybe, I don't think so. I don't think this is, mother of the bride for the ceremony. This is definitely a dress mother of the bride for a bridal shower. It doesn't have pockets though, but I like the color and it has this nice, um, what is this called? Elastic right under the bust line, which I think it cinches your waist in just a little bit. It is sleeveless, but we do have these little, these little flutters here that I think really really help give you a little bit more coverage on your arms if that's important to you. And it is to me, but I like it. I think it's sweet. Um, I'm 5'3". It does fit me really pretty good in the length. I would probably would wear some wedges with this, but I think that this is a really cute dress and it's a beautiful color. I really, really like this one. I don't think we found the wedding dress yet but um, we got a good start and I was happy to be able to try these on to give a little bit of a review and maybe to give you a little bit of a better idea of the size and the fit and honestly the quality of the, eye, of the dresses that we received today. Let's go over to the table and let's discuss everything that we tried on today. I'm pleasantly surprised with these dresses. Oh, I shouldn't even say that I'm pleasantly surprised. I have really been blown away by the quality of the formal attire that I have gotten from Shein. It has been just as nice and just as good as quality as dresses that I have tried on in bridal stores for three, four, five hundred dollars. So if you are looking for a formal dress to wear to any kind of event and a wedding, New Year's, or just a night out with your friends, then check out Shein for some great options for you. The measurements are all in the listing, so make sure that you are paying attention to that if you are tall or if you are short. I tend to have a hard time because I am 5'3", and a lot of things end up dragging the ground, which is why wedges are a short girl's best friend sometimes when it comes to a longer dress. And also, you know, having a good, stable undergarment on hand which I didn't have today. But honestly, the, the search is still on, um, but I'm probably gonna check out Shein's website for some different options for a future video. So let me know. You can say, say Misty, uh, uh, no. Uh, let me know which one was your favorite. And I'm curious, what is the protocol for a you know afternoon wedding in the fall? I don't think we need to wear sequins and that sort of stuff. It's not that fancy of an event and it's a small wedding as well. So um, not found the right one for me yet, but lots of great options over on Shein. So if you're looking for some formal wear or just any kind of clothing or casual wear as well, then check out Shein. And the best part about it is you can use my 15% off discount, which is down in the description of this video. Thank you guys again so much for watching. We're going on this journey together. Hopefully we'll find a dress. I don't know. Um, but thank you guys again so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.
Ding, 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 ding,